2021 Clovis Invitational just finished up the boys championship race. Newberry Park, 19 points, team time, one hour, 13 minutes, 37 seconds, completely obliterated the course record by 111 seconds. Multiple national championship teams have competed on this course before. Also, also broke cross country 5K national record. What are your thoughts? It was, I mean, it went according to plan. I wish we went out a little faster. Um, our guys, you know, I saw the smile split was a little slow. I knew that it was really about our top four pushing the pace through the whole race. Um, but I, I'll tell you, I am proud of Hector Martinez today and Daniel Appleford. I don't know, they were somewhere between 15-10, 15-15. I don't know their exact time. I saw them come in. I haven't even looked at the results. But those guys, Daniel's on the rise because he's been, you know, he's been out for a while, but now he's good. Um, and Hector stepped up. You know, I mean, shoot, he, he was sick all week, too. So we, were, we, were, we actually didn't decide to run him until Thursday. So we weren't sure, but sometimes those things work out and you benefit, you know? So I, I was, I, I, that's what I'm, I'm proud of my five and six today, big time. I mean, obviously with the guys ran up front, but I feel like that was a little bit more expected. But I think our five stepped up today. You know how good they are. You know how well how in shape they are. You mentioned about the fact that you wish they were faster with the one mile mark. But during the race, what were your emotions like? What was going through your mind other than the mile split? I wanted, I wanted a hard effort today. So I, I was screaming at the guys to run. I felt they looked a little comfortable at like the, right before mile and a half, my, our top four. I felt my six looked comfortable. My five was running well. So that was, I, today was all about effort. It's like, like we, I, I was even saying yesterday, it's like we're focusing on our race only and what we can do. I knew we could average, um, I don't know what that team average is under the 15 minutes, but that, I knew we could average well under 15 minutes today. And that's kind of what we were going for. I wasn't really concerned about all the outside noise or anything. I really wanted, I wanted them to run hard. I wanted to be dead tomorrow from today's run. Right. Yeah, I think your team time would probably average, if my math is right, 14.43 for your okay. scoring five, which, again, that broke the team time record by 22 seconds a man. Right. Crushed us. What's next? Um, for us, this is the part of the season I like. Um, we train for four weeks. We have an un uninterrupted uh, training block. We have um, you know, two, uh, three 10 day cycles that we, we run through and um, we just get ready for a league, which we could, you know, kind of run through pretty, pretty uh, solid. Uh, CIF prelims and CIF finals. Um, I don't think you're gonna see magic at prelims or finals from us, but at this state meet, you know, with no NXN, you know, we're going to Alabama, but with no NXN, we want to do something special at this state meet that no one's ever seen. That, and that's our guys and my girls too, you know? Next thing, the girls. Yeah. So at Woodbridge, we saw a great class between you guys and Buchanan among the yeah. California schools. Today was a rematch, a flip in the order. Yeah. Buchanan won. Again, great showdown, very, very close. What were your thoughts? And Sam McDonald ran an incredible race, won. What are your thoughts? Well, Sam McDonald followed the plan to the T. She didn't go out fast enough, but I didn't want her leading, so that was, she kind of had to do that. But she pushed when she had to push. She laid the pressure on when she had to lay the pressure on. I mean, and then had it at the end. I mean, that was like, the way we wrote it down was like the way it, it, it pinned out. We knew between her and Sadie, that's what we pinned. There wasn't um, anyone else, that, any big guns in there that we thought would, would uh, you know, match her. But the, uh, the rest of the girls, you know, we have a little work to do. But um, again, it, I think this is the time of year everybody's sick. Um, the, our girls were all healthy for this. And, you know, a couple weeks ago was a little rough for us. Um, we, we came in ready, ready to do something big. I think we did, but the bottom line is Buchanan was better today. I mean, you know, he did a great job with those girls and like this is their home course and they showed us like how good they are and now we're going to just have to wait, uh, you know, the six weeks and get, and you know, six, seven weeks and get ready for that state meet and it, it's good. It's good to have a battle, you know. This is why we wanted to be Division One. I. I wanted, I didn't want to go in two and win by all the big amount. I wanted, if we're going to win a title, let's win the overall title, you know. Right. And they're a good team. They're always good, you can. All right, Newberry Park again, a thriller on the girls' side, narrow loss on the boys' side, crushing the national records and the course record, destroying it. Coach Sean Brosnan of Newberry Park, thank you.